love to. Ignition sequence start. Five, four, three, two, one. Lifeless planet. Today, we're on the little planet, has little man on new planet. Can I jump? Yes, I can. What can I do? Nothing else. Alright. So, what do I do? Aye. My head is killing me. It feels like I have a concussion. And where's my crew? Alrighty. Hard landing. My head is foggy. The sound of my breath puffing in my helmet is hollow and distant. It's hard to tell how long I've been unconscious. And I'm worried. But I might have a concussion. I wish I could lay back down and rest. See if the pain passes, but the situation is far too critical. To call that a hard landing would be kind. We crashed. Maybe the eggheads miscalculated the trajectory. Or maybe we just hit a spell of bad luck. Whatever the case may be, this is not the paradise they described to us back home. There is no lush greenery, there is no sign of life at all. And where is my crew? I hope they're just securing a perimeter and that I was only out for a few minutes. I need to find them, get their status, and figure out just what in the heck happened. Ah, crap. I needed to do it before I run out of air. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's facts. Alright. Is there a sprint? Okay. I guess it's always on sprint. I'm seeing a trail here. Oh, I have a double jump. Also, I'm seeing this here, so I'm going to follow this, see where it leads. Because it looks like a trail. So I'm going to follow it. Crap. An oxygen leak. Nah, crap. Well, it would probably help if you didn't have tubes just hanging off your waist when you landed. I mean, really. I see some light. All right, all right, all right. Get in there, get in there. The trail leads there too. Even though it's really hard to see, I don't know if you guys can see it on screen. Yeah, it's this little line right here. All right, get inside. But it's leaking. Can I get a spare tank, or what's the story? Eh, alright. Path. Okay. Hmm. Is this the way to go? I'm not seeing a path. I do be lost. I understand that even at twice the speed of light, your journey will take 15 years. That's right. Ah. We'll be traveling so fast, our spacecraft will arrive at the planet before the transmission of this interview does. But it's still such a long trip. We'll be put into a sort of coma. Our heart rate will be slowed dramatically to minimize aging during the flight. How do you prepare for this one-way mission, knowing you will never return to Earth? Well, I have a volunteer crew of very skilled and focused individuals. We all have a deep desire to explore, to go somewhere new. And frankly, we also have a few attachments here on Earth. Oh! 
Well, our journey was for nothing. <laughs> okay then. So, what will be the plan then? Fascinating. There will be a cave. There's water here. So you'd think there'd be life here, but I don't know what happened. Unless there's aliens. A thingy. What's that? Alright. Jetpack functional. Everything about this mission is a disaster so far. The lander took a beating, and with it, most of my equipment. My suit is functional, but barely. The jetpack can still put out a single burst, which is useful for short jumps. I find I get the most distance when I trigger the burst at the top of my jumps. Okay. Oops. Righty. Roy. And a heap. And a hoof. And a hoof. Ah! Yep. Yep. All right, all right, all right. Oopa loopa. Oopa loopa. There we go. Noise. All right. Why are there no signs of life? On this there are no signs of intelligent life anywhere. <laughs> All right, Buzz Lightyear. I was following a track we left behind by my crew, but got separated from their trail. Hopefully I can make my way around. In the meantime, I still can't understand why this planet is barren and lifeless. My remote observations were conclusive. This planet was rich with life, so where did it go? Maybe we dropped in, dropped in in the wrong spot. But initial readings aren't coming up with any trace of biological activity. Yeah. Just goes to show, no, isn't it? Can I jump on this? No, all right. I'm guessing I gotta go there, so I start over here. Yeet. Or not. It's all over the place, though. Alrighty. Oh, nope, it just does like a re really weird zigzag. Stalling for time, are we? Yup. Sorry if you guys hear a train. There's a train going by. Ah. Oh. Excuse you. Move the rock. Alright. What does that do exactly? Okay, okay. Gotta grab onto it. Okay. Hmm. Obviously I'm not going this way. Don't say. Alright. Get. Get, ya boy. Eh, 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 senora. Yep. There we go. Progress. We have made the lot of the progress. You do. Raw. I wonder if there's fall damage. Because it sounds like there might be. No life signs, huh? Hey. Oh, well, it's gone now. What are these tadpoles or something? Where? Hmm. I don't think we're going back that way. I think we're going this way. Because um, these rocks are stacked. Just searching away. Ah, a light source. Ah ha ha. Go, go, go. Ah. Uh, huh? 
Mamma mia! Help me! Ah, lui, barota! Alright. Excuse you. <laughs> Alrighty. Guess we're going up. Ooh. It's a book. A Russian book. Oh. Ah. Uh, hmm? Oh no, have we reversed back to Earth? Oh no. Oh no. Are we on Earth? What is going on here? Huh? That's what I'd like to know, actually. Great, I'm American, so. Hmm. There are no words to emphasize my pride as I begin our experiments here on this new world. When they described the green fire to me, it sounded artificial, like something drawn in an animation. To imagine I would lay eye my eyes on a world so colorful, I am overwhelmed by its beauty. And now, we begin a difficult journey to cultivate this place in the name of the motherland. The government of the West calls our intentions aggressive. They do not believe in our sovereignty, that is, our Soviet Union. But we have seen so many victories, we repelled Germany's aggression and a glorious rise to power, and fought with valor to spread the communist ideal to other broken nations. But when we accomplish here, we draw the Soviet Union ahead of the entire world without even firing a shot. We will power the entire Soviet Union, what we learned here. And I am the one who will lead us. Hmm. I keep pressing escape, I should stop that. Oxygen. How is this possible? So, the Soviets got here first, is what it's saying. Interesting, interesting. But what happened? That what? Trackway? Maybe he means this. Just get up all of these things. Oh, right here. Okay. Trackway. Got it. He's a little footy prince. We got the photo of the footy prince. All the way to this weird tower. I wonder what's inside. Well, that's not good. Yeet! It's after me! Oh boy, it's not a voter, get out, get out, so I could eat one of the first eight of the day. Get that side. Are you okay? Oh man, this is messed up. Listen, you're almost out of oxygen. I'm pretty low myself, but I'm gonna give you everything I can. I think there may be some air canisters in that town. Okay, you're gonna be alright now. Just hang in there, buddy. We'll figure this out together, alright? Oh. Ah. Well. Did this become tremors mixed with Soviet Union again? God damn it. First half of code for access to Southern Laboratory, 331. In keeping with security protocol, this portion of the security code must be kept separate from the other half of the code. Right. right. So, there's alien life, but it seems as though something else has happened. Hmm. He mentioned town, so I'm gonna go there next. We're going heading back to town, then. I 
I see something there. It do be shiny. I don't be seeing the shiny. Life has gotten very hard here. I want to go home so much. My brother said, I, oh wait, hang on. I think I should come back for this. Mm -hmm. Have I been burning through oxygen doing this? Because if so, that's probably a bad idea. Come on, get to the canister! Options. Okay. Well, I guess I'll have to come back to it then. Hmm. That's a fence work, so... Am I missing something? Probably something else in that house. I guess I gotta go that way. Looks like there's some stuff over there, so... Hmm. Yo, -do. Maybe there's some ages on these graves. Discovered a collection of makeshift graves outside the town. Whatever and wherever this place is, it seems things didn't end well for the inhabitants. I was following a track that I left behind by my crew and they got separated from their trail. Hopefully I can make my way around. Ah, here we go. Okay. Chibrushka. Laughter music. Babushka's samovar. Medicine, fresh bread, no. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> Alright. Of course you'd miss Mommy. Okay, so, 331. There's gotta be another half here somewhere. Yeet. It's locked. Find both parts of the code. All right, should be in town. Hmm. Maybe one of these houses will have something. I was directed back to the oxygen, so... And maybe in that general vicinity. It'd be funny if some dude just came out without a helmet on and he's just like, Hey guys, how's it going? It's fine. It's completely fine. Just take off your helmet, that'll be a good deal. And then it's just like, oh, so in case it dies. Yeah, that'll be good. Hmm. I looked at that. That's over. Hmm. What about over here? Just a big ol' canyon. Alright. My tea! Oh, excuse me. Out of all these houses, there's a red one. So... My guess is that this is the command house. Maybe. Knock, knock. Anybody home? Do scotch clever on you. Ah, there's an opening in the roof. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Alright. Now I just need to find a way up. This camera is so freaking weird. <gasps> Ooh! Oh, there's a light here. What is the point of all this? Okay. I need to stay calm. For 15 years, I hung in cryo like a bag of forgotten frozen vegetables. That's what they said, anyway. They played us real good with the with that story that they spun. Another planet suitable for housing human life? Can't believe I fell for it. I actually have to compliment them on the lack of oxygen. That's a real nice touch. Of course, they probably just tampered with the meters. I bet I could take off the summit right now. 
Is that what this is? A test to see how long it takes us to break protocol? I'm not some rocky jockey kid playing at being an astronaut. What in the world is the point of all this? And where did they take my crew? Need to stay calm. My head is still spinning from the crash. Probably need a doctor. I bet they think that's so funny. Eh. Bop. Hmm. I think if I stood on this one here. Ah. Yeet, 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 yeet. Whoop. Perfect. Alright. Burp. And a burp. Perfect. Ah, perfect. Nice. Alright, let's go check out that bunker. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hopefully I don't get attacked by um predator or something. Yeet. Yeet. Burp. Shoop. Zoop. Another one for the wind. Another one for the wind. Looks like it's coming out of my butt cheeks. Great. Was there a cliff here or something? Yes. Alright. So there's a bunker. Every instinct in my body is saying, Don't do it, Captain. But, as Starship Log provides, we must go forward. Research complex. Alright, we're in a hole. Alright, boys. We're in now. This is quite the uh, ordeal. Bam! I wonder what's in here. There's another bed up ahead. That shouldn't be good. Hmm. I must be on some LSD or some shit. There's always that eerie feeling that there's someone behind you. Someone close, just behind your ear, whispering, following, it's in the darkness. We are never truly alone, but I guess that's kind of what they want you to believe, now isn't it? As we descend into the madness that is, we start to question, was there even sanity? Or was it always madness? Food for thought. Alright. Hmm. This is starting to look real Half-Life-esque. Or 007. Eh. Button, you got the power. Alright. Alright. Okay, gotta jump across and do the hoopity shoopity. A hoop and a zoop. Ah, God. gonna be a long day. Woo! Reflection. Up. Oh, looks like Bobby didn't make it. Three nights ago, I managed to barricade myself in the room. With any luck, they won't be able to get in here. Of course, I'll have daddy's luck myself on my own too. I realize I'm nearly... I'm near the end. 
The calls from the other posts have dwindled over the last two days for two hours since anyone has responded. I made peace with the idea of my death, but I wish I didn't have to face it alone. I'm guessing this is study hall? I guess the communism finally broke down. Uh -huh. <gasps> Bombs. I bet I can make use of this. Bomb. I hold it like child because I am communist. Alright. You hold bomb like child because it's communism. Alright. Where do I put bomb? <laughs> Not here. Bomb. Bam. Beef. Huh? Here we are. Run! Maybe I need more bombs. Never mind. Alright, let's see what's up here. Let's see if there's any secrets. Nope. Alright. Probably gonna need another bomb. But you never know. Yeet. So the Russians found some kind of portal transported them to this planet. Ah. And then things went terribly wrong. Oh boy. Did Hitler make it through? I found my way into some sort of research facility. I came across the skeletal remains of one former lab worker. Documents nearby indicate the Russians built some sort of portal system that led here. Though I'm still not certain where here is, this place appears to be a colony. Like they weren't fully established before something went wrong. CCCP. Ah, ha, ha. Am I gonna fall into Stranger Things? Is that what's going on here? Hmm. Oh boy, here we go. Let me guess. Sickness? The virus is spreading faster now. Our efforts to contain it have so far been futile. We haven't given up hope, however. We haven't given up hope, however. My colleagues are working timelessly, or tirelessly. We are not dealing with terrestrial species, and thus there is so much we don't know. The challenge is so great, and yet we will prevail. We must prevail. So they were dealing with a virus. Did it wipe out all plant life too? Jesus. It's quite the plague you got going on there, bud. This is odd. Ah, uh, okay. Great. Okay, oh, here we are. There's a thingy. What is this? Поразительно. Amazing. With each test we run, the samples appear more promising. I'll add more details later. Simply isn't time right now. Interesting, interesting. Hmm. An entity? Great. I think my mind is playing tricks on me. I think my mind is playing tricks on me. I thought for a moment I was back on Earth. After the hallucination passed, I found a, hum a human trackway leading out of the underground facility. The footprints glow green, for reasons I can't explain. I took some samples, but I haven't had time to analyze. The footprints seem to lead out of the facility, so for now I'm going to follow them, but with caution. Starship log. We are tracking down a woman who by some form of the means has gained the ability to leave glowy footprints on further notice I am hungry and something smells like diapers oh bad sesame this ain't gonna be good mm. oh, really? Get in there. Oh, Jesus Christ. It stopped just a hair out of it. There do be a light up there. 
Yeet. Yeet. We need ah. to find a way to turn this on. Hmm. All right, follow the wire. And a hoopity and a shoopity up. Ba ba da. Ah. Ba ba da ba ba da. We're dealing with stranger things all over again. Here we go. I like the mini light. You can stick that right up the butt cheeks. Noise. Alright. Just don't clench or else you'll get a whole bunch of shards of glass in your anus. Ah well. Okay. Whoa, what was that? I hope that's not a graphical bug. Uh oh. And right. Okay. Hmm. Okay, find it. Eh. Gotta Skyrim this shit. Bap. 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 New. There we go. Burp. Burp. Mm. Okay. There was a great escape, it looks like. Hmm. Alright, so we're gonna have to continue this in the next episode. But we will find out what happens here. I am very interested. So, I hope you guys like this video, and eh, leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to see more of what is going to be happening in uh, Lifeless Planet. But for now, see you later guys. Bye bye for now.